Hello guys, my name is Victoria Pavlov, I'm the Photoshop artist and today we are starting a new series for um, St. Patrick's Day. We will start with um, shamrock painting and uh, we will be using Adobe Photoshop CC and painting tools um, in Adobe Photoshop CC. So guys, let's start. First of all, as you can see, I have created my document. You can create your document in any size you want to. Now I will create a new empty layer just like that i will switch color for my brush to um, the any shade of uh, gray color you can uh, use any color you want but i prefer to have a gray color and i will make my size size of my brush smaller by the way guys i'm using my vacuum cintiq if you cannot afford vacuum cintiq i will recommend you to use any tablet you can afford uh, on amazon you can buy any vacuum tablet for a way very affordable uh, price um, i cannot imagine how i will paint without my vacuum tablet so guys let's back to our painting i have my simple um, brush tool with a uh, gray color and by the way you can use any brush you are more, more comfortable with and now i will start outlining my uh, shamrock if you notice shamrock has um, each leaf has a shape of the heart so it's very easy to paint just like that and I, I'm not trying to be um, perfect with this um, outlining uh, process because I will fix everything later on I'm just outlining my uh, shamrock just like that and if I think I need to adjust anything, I just will adjust my outlines, just like that. This is my first leaf. Because I applied, I created my outline using a separate layer, I will duplicate this layer. I will use a um, move tool and I will move and rotate my leaf, just like that. just like that and I will accept this uh, layer and I will duplicate this layer one more time and using uh, same um, move tool I will flip it and I will rotate it now I have my um, three leaves just like that let me make it more close to each other just like that I will accept this layer I like it now I will add a new empty layer and using my um, paintbrush I will create the rest of my uh, shamrock just like that so guys now I have outlined my shamrock what I will do I will hide my background layer and I will merge all visible layers just like that and I will bring back my background layer I will bring down opacity for my uh, outline layer just like that I will create a new empty layer I will be using same paintbrush but I will change color for my paintbrush I will use green color for my uh, shamrock just like that shamrock is a spring um, uh, flower leaf so um, I prefer to use very bright and uh, springy colors just like that I will increase size for my brush and I will paint my first uh, leaf just like that uh, guys spend some time if you never uh, painted in Photoshop before and you have um, trouble to um, uh, creating outlines for your um, a shamrock I will recommend you to use a um, traditional uh, method of painting so you can uh, sketch out your uh, shamrock using um, paper scan it or take picture using your mobile device and bring this outline um, a file into Photoshop and you will be able to paint using paint uh, paintbrush so we have many different ways to start and finish our painting in Photoshop and I will cover all those ways um, later on in my uh, tutorials so guys what uh, I did I uh, 
created very nice uh, green color for my uh, leaf. Now I will duplicate this layer. Definitely I can continue uh, to paint each leaf separately, but to save you time I will duplicate this layer just like that. Using move tool I will rotate it just like that. I can uh, resize it if I want. I will accept this layer. I will duplicate my first green layer one more time. I will rotate it, flip it, and I will move it down just like that. If I will need and I need it, I will rotate it more just like that. Perfect. What I will do right now, I will hide my outline uh, layer and I will rename all my layers. This is the first layer. I will rename it like top layer just because it's very important top layer this is my uh, left layer I will rename it to the left and this is my right uh, leaf I will rename it to the right just like that now I can um, clearly see um, each layer and what I will do I will um, reposition my left layer just slightly just like that and also top layer. I can zoom in to better preview and using move tool I will bring it down just like that. Now I'm happy. Time to apply all details to our image. What I will do, I have highlighted my top layer. I will create a new layer. I will make my um, color a few shades darker just like that using same paint brush I didn't change anything I will apply few um, brush strokes so now we are putting together um, uh, dark and um, darkest and lightest uh, part of our image so guys um, um, working on this part of your painting I will recommend you to bring down and uh, re resize your brush um, as often as you need it. You cannot use same uh, uh, brush size all the time. So I will recommend you to change your um, brush size all the time. Just like that. What I will do, I will uh, merge uh, my uh, shade layer and a uh, top leaf just like that. Merge down. I will switch to my uh, mixer brush tool. You can use any mixer brush you are more comfortable with and I will uh, smooth uh, all colors. I will mix all colors together just like that. Perfect. Just like that. Now I will uh, highlight my left flower leaf. I will create a new empty layer. I will switch to my uh, brush tool and I will apply same shading to m my um, left uh, leaf just like that. I will increase size for my brush and just like that. Same in here. I will bring size of my brush down and I will apply shading in the middle of this leaf. Now I will merge down this layer. So this is top of my, this is shading layer of my left leaf. I will merge shading to the leaf, merge down. I will switch to the mixer brush tool and I will increase size for my mixer brush tool and I will um, mix together all the colors just like that. Guys, you need to admit that it's very easy to paint in Photoshop. Photoshop designed uh, pretty much for everything. Um, we can restore images in Photoshop, we can compose it. Um, images in Photoshop, we can paint, we can do many things in Photoshop. And I love, love, love Photoshop. So now I will highlight my top layer, my right uh, leaf. I will create a new empty layer. I will switch to my uh, a paint brush with same color and I will apply a few shading to my left size, right size of my leaf just like that. I will increase size for my brush just like that. 
and same in here and I will merge uh, my top layer so this is my uh, shading layer for my uh, right uh, leaf and this is my uh, right leaf I will merge both layers together I will switch to my mixer brush tool and I will uh, mix all colors together just like that same in here just like that now guys what I will do um, I will create a new empty layer I will switch to the color of, uh, with a lighter shade of my green color so I will just move slider upper just like that click OK I will bring down opacity of my um, brush paint brush about uh, 47 and I will apply a um, uh, light uh, uh, I will apply uh, I will bring some um, light accents to my uh, flower just just like that and guys because we are applying uh, light using separate uh, layer we can bring down opacity of this layer as well just like that and here and here and now I will do same I did previously I will merge uh, my top layers I will switch to my mixer brush tool and edit oh see I made mistake I applied my uh, light accent to the wrong leaf so I will do undo 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 now I more undo just like that I will bring my um, light layer on top of my top layer and I will merge all two layers together just like that using the mixer brush tool I will uh, mix all the uh, colors just like that perfect and now guys I will um, select my right layer this one I will uh, create a new empty layer I will switch back to my paint brush tool with same color but I will bring down opacity more for my brush about 23 and uh, I will apply few light effect to my um, right size of my leaf just like that perfect 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 and here and here and now I will merge um, two layers together I will I will merge my light uh, lighting layer and my um, right side of my uh, leaf just like that merge down switching back to the mixer brush tool and I will mix all um, colors together this is very important now what I will do guys I know you can guess I will select my left leaf just like that I will create a new empty layer I will switch to my simple brush tool and uh, I will apply few uh, lighting effects to my uh, left side of my uh, leaf just like that and here and now I will merge down my um, two layers I will switch back to my mixer brush tool and I will uh, mix together uh, my uh, colors perfect I love 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 it now guys what I will do let me mix uh, this part perfect now guys uh, what I will do I will select my um, top layer I will create a new empty layer I will make my um, color for my brush a few shades lighter I will slightly move my slider here click OK still I have a opacity for um, my um, let me switch for my brush about uh, probably about 11 
I will make my brush size much, much smaller, just like that. And I will apply extra effect, uh, extra accents to my leaf. So let's start putting together final details. Just like that. And here, fun, right, guys? And I can guarantee you can do it. You can do it, guys. Now, I will switch to another color. I will make uh, my color few shades darker than my leaf, just like that. And I will apply um, shade to my leaf, just like that. Everything, guys, uh, between um, dark and light uh, parts of our image is very important because um, applying shading and lighting to your image, you are creating 3D dimension. So, and your leaf uh, will look more natural. This is important. Just like that. And uh, here. And what I will do now, guys, no surprise in here, I will merge my uh, accent layer and my top leaf, side of my leaf, merge down. I will switch back to my mixer brush tool. I will bring size down for my mix brush tool and I will mix my colors just like that. So, guys, as you can see, it's easy. It's easy. It's fun. Um, if you will be creating um, same art for uh, your St. Patrick's Day, uh, what I'm showing you now, uh, please guys sh share it with me. I would like to see the result. Share with me on uh, Twitter. Just hashtag me. On Twitter, I'm uh, Victoria underscore uh, Pavlov. I will make my uh, mixer brush tool um, size bigger and I will continue smoothing up all uh, colors. So just like that, guys. Now what I will do, guys, and again, no surprise in here, I will select highlight my left um, leaf. I will create a new empty layer. I will switch back to the lighter shade of my green color and I will create a few accents in here, just like that. Here. You can create your leaf in a more artistic style if you want. You, uh, uh, you need to use bigger size of your uh, brush and you need to use more texture with your brush. Guys, I, I will cover everything in my uh, uh, tutorials later on. I will cover uh, all uh, painting styles for you. So stay with me. And if you like my um, channel, please subscribe and like my uh, tutorial. So what I will do now, I will bring opacity up uh, for my uh, dark, dark side part of my leaf, just like that. And I will continue applying shading to my leaf, just like that. And guys, if you have any questions, please, please, please ask. What I will do now, guys, I will bring down opacity for this layer, just like that, slightly, not too much. Now I have my accent layer and my left uh, part of my uh, uh, shem shamrock. I will merge two layers together. I will switch back to the mixer brush tool and I will um, uh, mix all uh, colors and all accents together. Just like that. Same in here. Just like that. Now, guys, I will select my uh, right uh, side of my uh, flower, my uh, leaf. I will create a new empty layer. I will switch to the lightest um, shade of my green color. 
just I will switch to my um, brush tool and I will apply few um, effects to the uh, right part of my leaf just like that guys don't be scared if you made any mistake you think you made any mistake you easily can fix anything in Photoshop uh, we are using layers so we have many ways to undo our mistakes so no, no reason to be uh, afraid or uh, stressed during your painting or uh, any other workflow in Photoshop so those my light accents I will switch to the darker shade of my green color and I will apply rest of my accent for this part of my leaf just like that and voila what I will do now guys I will merge my two top layers my accent layer and my right uh, leaf just like that merge down I will switch back to my mixer brush tool and I will mix together uh, all the colors just like that and again guys um, don't try uh, to paint using your uh, mouth I will recommend you to use any um, tablet you can afford I am a Wacom user I'm using Wacom all my life and I'm happy with my uh, Wacom so now I will switch to my uh, simple brush tool I will make a uh, size for my brush smaller and I will apply few uh, last accents to this uh, layer and as you notice guys I'm not creating a new empty layer because I know what I'm doing in here I just need few um, accents like that and same in here and voila I will switch back to my mixer brush tool and I will make size for my mixer brush smaller and I will smooth all colors together just like that uh, if you never painted in Photoshop uh, definitely uh, obviously you will spend more time on your painting uh, from the beginning and after that you will be more experienced and you will know what you are doing and everything will be much easier and more enjoyable so guys this is my leaf now we will create a rest of our leaf I will highlight my um, outline layer remember guys we created this layer I will create a new empty layer I will switch um, back to darkest um, shade of my green color switch back to my uh, brush tool I will make my brush size bigger just like that and I will create a rest of my um, uh, leaf but before that I will restock my layers I will bring this layer on top of all layers and now time to finish our flower our leaf just like that I will bring opacity up to 100% and just like that I will hide my um, uh, outline layer I will make my size brush size smaller and I will continue just like that what I will do now guys I will create a new extra layer I will uh, bring down opacity for this layer just like that and I will apply last uh, effect to my uh, flowers my flower my leaf just like that now I will highlight my steam uh, layer I will um, switch to my eraser tool and I will erase part of my leaf because I uh, my uh, steam because I think it's too big just like that and voila 
Now, guys, um, I will select my background layer. I create a new empty layer. I will switch uh, color for my brush. Uh, probably, let's see, it to something more um, just like this. Uh, any color you can use. I will use a light shade of blue color just like that. I will switch uh, to um, a paint basket tool and voila. Now I will merge uh, my uh, leaf layers but before that I will delete my uh, outline layer. I don't need this layer anymore. Yes please. Also I will delete my background layer. I don't need this layer anymore. I will hide my um, blue uh, layer and I will merge my all layers, more, merge visible. Now I have two layers, one leaf and one background layer. What I will do, I will resize my leaf, make it bigger just like that. Click OK and now I will merge all visible, merge visible. I will duplicate this layer just in case. I will switch to my mixer brush tool and I will continue fixing my leaf. So I would like to create all lines smooth and flowing. Uh, so it will be one a piece of art. We will not separate a layers. We will not um, we will uh, we will not have two layers, one uh, our leaf and another our background. We have one piece of art just like that. So basically I'm uh, uh, smoothing up uh, edges of my leaf just like that. And I'm using mixer brush tool guys just like that. And also steam. Just like that and all other parts of my leaf. I'm using same mixer brush tool guys. I'm not switching to any other tool. Just like that. So it's like um, in traditional painting um, we are using a brush to mix our colors, to blend our colors blending a brush same in here i'm using my as uh, a mixer brush so like blending a brush i'm I bl i'm blending all uh, layers all colors together just like that and voila i'm pretty much happy with my uh shamrock so guys this is what i wanted to share with you and when you will be satisfied with, uh, satisfied with your final uh, steps, uh, um, delete all uh, layers and you will have only one layer. If you don't want to merge all layers together, if you would like to have all layers separately, save your file as PSD file without merging layers. But sometimes it's not impossible because um, I prefer to smooth my... Um, lines uh, uh, by the end using the mixer brush tool. So uh, what I will recommend you in this way, um, when you will be in your final stage of your uh, workflow, I will recommend you to, to duplicate your project and uh, your document and merge um, all layers together in a duplicated uh, document. So guys, this is what I wanted to share with you. If you have any questions as usual, please ask. I will be more than happy to answer to any of them. And I will see you next time. Thank you, guys. Bye.